champion Benema going in this. The European champion Kaita, the reigning European champion Duarte, the reigning world champion Ilsa Hayes and former world record holder. We start off in lane two, first major championships from Hoth in Dublin. The club Rahini Shamrock, it's Orla Comerford and she turns 19 in three days time. Lane three for Morocco. Gold in Beijing and the one, the two and the four for Sana Benama. The 200 and 400 reigning European champion from France, reigning world champion over four, Nanatin Kaita. The world record holder, formerly current world champion over one and two for South Africa, it's Ilsa Hayes. The new world record holder, 11.82 in the semi finals for Ukraine, Lelia Hadzamatova. Lane seven for the United States, silver in the 200 meters, bronze in the one in the world championships in Doha, based in Chico, California. It's Kim Crosby, the former world champion over 100 and 400 from Lyon in 2013. For Ukraine, from Dnipro, Elena Glebova. And in lane nine, the reigning European champion for Portugal, from Madeira, the Maritimo Club, Carolina Duarte. Silver in the two, bronze in the four, and Grissetto, as well as that 100 meters gold. Fast track, sprinters are loving it. Crowd are loving the fast times. And Zamatova, particularly in that semi final. So Kummerfeld in two, Benema three, Kaita four, Hayes five, and Zamatova six, Crosby seven, Glebova eight, Duarte in lane nine the final of the women's 100 meters t13 away first time it's amatova left in the blocks a little bit crosby started brilliantly for the united states hayes going well here comes it's amatova it's amatova and hayes between these two it's amatova has the upper hand she has the gold hayes second 11.80 is another new world record and amatova's got the upper hand on hayes again crosby got the bronze and she's taken another further hundredth off it 11.79 has been rounded down to and it's Amatova absolutely magnificent Hayes got the silver medal Amatova just kept running and running thought she was going to do a, a further 150 meters there and she was a little slow out of the box, blocks it has to be said but made up for that over the closing 50 to claim a new world record in collecting the gold 11.79 so Three hundredths off the mark she earlier set. Elsa Hayes did throw down the challenge. Beside her in lane five. And uh, Kim Crosby, the United States, probably made the best of the starts. Then Elsa Hayes and Atsumatova moved past her. And Atsumatova just kept going and going and going. <laughs> she's, she's got around the bend at about three-quarter pace. So delighted was she. It was around 70 when that gap began to emerge and Hayes, I think, knew at that point that under natural means she wasn't going to do it. Only a stumble would see it. Zamatova denied. Crosby just pipping Glebova, Ukraine. She wasn't brilliantly out of the marks, though. You have to say it's Zamatova. Hayes brilliantly away, a fantastic start. But then it was in the final 50 when she finally got moving. Crosby, for me, is the best start of all. But a very strong finish to hold off the U other Ukrainian to get the bronze medal. And this is where, really, Zamatova came into her own. A new world record. That 11.82, the lifetime best, was in a non-IPC event, the world record 11.86 going into this, so it's an even wider margin in which she's managed to do that. Crosby third, Glebova in fourth place. Both of them with lifetime best, too. This is a brilliant track. If only we could take it home with us. <laughs> Move and, it around the world. And Zamatova, world record, 11.79 gets the gold. Hayes, silver 11.91.